development that creates a world that you know won't run out of the things we need and that'll uh, support human life and dignity for everybody. Justice, equality, and not compromising our future for generations to come. Sustainable development means to me ensuring a planet that is able to fully outfit the current population with all the resources necessary to live a suitable human life while ensuring that doing so will not inhibit future generations from enjo enjoying a life of similar comforts and hopefully of more comforts that will be developed sustainably. So to me, sustainable development principally requires peace. And in the Rio Declaration, one of the Rio principles said that warfare is inherently destructive of sustainable development. I think in the Rio Plus 20 process, the role of peace for uh, current and future generations really needs to be given priority attention. Get moving. We don't have time. You know, you have these conferences and then it's like, well, we'll see you at the next conference to talk about the same things. And I mean, we know the things we know and it's time for action. Listen to each other and listen to civil society. I actually want something to happen. I don't want them to also say what they said 20 years ago and never did. I just want them to do it. Get your act together. You've been killing people for hundreds of years and allowing the decimation of the planet. It's time to pick up the pieces, start on the road for a new future and give up all the old stuff and clean, uh, wipe the slate clean and start anew. The world that I'm inheriting and the people that are coming behind me are inheriting is not looking really well. And if you want a better future for your grandchildren and your children, it's time to get moving.